Let's unwrap the member CG album, wrap the egg yolk. Just beginning, how are you all doing? Welcome back to Godzilla PS4. Yes, I've did some live streams and now it is an official video with Mothra vs. Godzilla 2014, as you see on the screen right there. But if you don't know, I'm almost in here to table the free, well, Godzilla content possible. Swipe and in the raptor claw on that subscribe and bell button to get notified for more Godzilla goodness and get your. Oh, I almost wanted to say Godzilla merch. What? <laughs> on teespring.com slash store slash LB Gossy. Link for that will be in the description box below. With that being said, yes, let's do it. We have Godzilla 2014 versus our Mothra. This is the, uh, well, defense actually mode in God of Destruction mode. And look at this intro. It, it always gets me. You can hear the mighty, mighty roar in a second. There you go. <laughs> there it is. Beautiful. <laughs> Which will be battling, like I said before. Look at that. Uh oh. It's Godzilla. There we go. And we have our beautiful Mothra. Of course, this is the video game <laughs> Mothra, not the King of the Monsters version Mothra. I kind of wish that they didn't delete this game from the PlayStation Store, and it's not. You can't get this anymore in your local uh, game store. I don't know why. They, they stopped producing this game. So I kind of wish they added new kaijus like Shin Godzilla or newer versions. And uh, basically, <laughs> the, I battled Godzilla. And <laughs> this is not movie based. I absolutely wrecked Godzilla 2014, the highest 100 meter class. This is supposed to be a very difficult battle. <laughs> I just had to share this because it was unbelievable. I was. <laughs> this is not movie based, <laughs> but it's beautiful even with the <laughs> animations. I <laughs> I couldn't contain myself. This is absolute beauty. I'm sorry, Godzilla, but Mothra is absolutely whopping your head. <laughs> Oh my word, it was done in like two minutes. This is a two minute match. <laughs> Godzilla is going down like it's nothing. Mothra is the way to go. Look at that. <laughs> it doesn't stand a chance. And for the final one, I wanted to end with a beam. And here it goes. This is what you get with your atomic breath. There you go. <laughs> beautiful. And then we have a building as an area clear screen. That was beautiful, wasn't it? Beautiful Mothra, I have powered. I don't even have <laughs> any evolutions attached to it. Uh, modified, as some would say. But, uh, <laughs> there we go. And on the next battle, we have, yeah, um, going to start it now. It's we Godzilla. have the Godzilla. There we go. <laughs> the Godzilla versus, the old Godzilla versus, what shall it be? be oh, my word. There must, uh, there is. There is. Got, yeah, okay, so this is almost at the end of the game. I was thinking, should I do a playthrough? Let me know what you think, if I should do that. Uh, but I was thinking more of these battle videos, because they would be more entertaining. And, uh, well, throughout the playthrough, we do encounter kaijus for every area. that we have to face a Mecha Godzilla, King Ghidorah, uh, Angiris, uh, Jet Jaguar, etc, etc. Destoroya. But, um, yeah, this is the campaign, but I just wanted to do these normal fighting uh, videos. Let me know what you think of that. And uh, it's just a new thing that I want to do on this channel. I want to go more in the direction of Godzilla, because, you know, I love Godzilla, and I think it's a very cool co uh, concept. A bit of a change from all the dinosaur and Jurassic World stuff, you know? Sometimes you just want to shake it up and try something new. That's what I'm kind of trying right now. So if you enjoyed it, please stick around. And uh, maybe we can even get new, well, Raptor members. Mm. Kaiju members. Mm, how about that? Do you have your own Kaiju name? Mm. Let me know down in the comments. Alright, thank you, GeForce Operator. Thank you so much. Ah, uh, yes, of course. System. So there is a timer. That is the twist. The population will not be pleased to bear nope. the cost of no, being that is, again. yeah. But if it means stopping Godzilla from growing stronger, <laughs> well, we kind of want Godzilla to grow stronger. That's the whole point of this video game. You gotta <laughs> grow uh, above 100 meters and face a very difficult creature at the what end. But a lot of the way, you're kind of facing different kind of kaiju. Uh, with, of course, the military trying to grab a piece of this cake. 
and we're trying to take down the first generator which gives us G energy which makes us more powerful and taller and bigger and instead, well giving us more of a chance to stand up against the taller and stronger kaijus throughout the series so yeah now we are going for the second generator there we go <laughs> there is a timer so I, I do have to hurry up Aha, and what should I, uh, my opponent be? Yes, our opponent at this point. <laughs> Gotta watch out for the shield. Oh, there we go. This is a secret project, huh? Go Tango. Ow! <laughs> Apparently, uh, I recorded this a few days ago, but of course my skill improves every single day. I've been grinding this game. I've already finished it. <laughs> I already know what <laughs> happens. I already have a lot of evolution points for all the kaijus, um, but I just wanted to show you guys the old recordings because they, are, of course, they're still the same. But it's not like you're, I'm facing new hybrids, but my skill has improved, and I know a lot of like tricks on what to do at some point. It's it's all about timing and how to actually attack the generators and kaijus on what's the best um, combo attacks and stuff like that, so you don't lose um, time or when you need to attack. And you need to collect these data points that we have right here. Epic. Katango in the background. What are you doing, Katango? Why are you always interfering? <laughs> oh my word. It's always that. What I do notice with some Godzillas, actually, it's very difficult to hit these uh, Katango thing because you get into G-Force Super X uh, projects that sometimes occur throughout the playthrough. But some of them don't actually have the special ability this Godzilla has that destroys everything in its, well, I guess 50 meter radius or 20, I don't know, 20 to 50 meter radius. And uh, yeah, with the other Godzilla such as 2014, you don't have that, you just have a tail swamp like this. This is this is good. I wanted this for Godzilla 2014 as well, but then I realized, oh wait, <laughs> it doesn't do that in a movie. So it would be a bit unrealistic to have, you know, powers for a Godzilla that doesn't appear in the movies. But this Godzilla did have that power. I think so. There's like 15,000 Godzilla. So if I'm wrong, I'm sorry. I see Gotengo coming and I'm trying to damage it, but yes, it drills a hole in me at the same time. When's the other Kaiju uh, coming? Uh, <laughs> Ah, yes. This is... I, I, Yeah, so this is me the first time playing on this map because I don't have the data points. So I didn't really have... Oh, wow, I just realized I did not have a clue on what to actually do. I was like thinking, what is that thing? What is, what is the one for me? Goldie, come on. You, you're standing on a data point. It says new. Collect it, please. Press R3. Oh, boy. What could that be? It's either King Ghidorah or Space Godzilla. I can't remember anymore. Ow. Oh, yeah, this is... <laughs> I'm, like, so angry about a, like, cutscene at the <laughs> worst time. Because the disaster level upgraded to level 4. It's like the wanted level on GTA. <laughs> you have the stars, well, this... Here you have the disaster levels. Yes, and Katango getting a nice hit. There we go. A kaiju has appeared. Okay. Who is it? Oh boy. Ah! Space Godzilla. On the wrong map! This is not the correct map for the... <laughs> well, there we go. Ah! That is a beautiful Space uh, Godzilla. But the mountains and greenest forest you saw in the background is not on this map. It's on the other map. On um, Area 4, I guess. Oh. Wow. Gatango. Is it still... No, I did not get it. Look how massive it is! Oh my word! Space Godzilla 90 meter class. It's 8 meters uh, taller than us. So it will have an advantage and it can push us down. But Gotango is actually helping us um, defeat this Space Godzilla. But I didn't want to have... Oh my word. And now I'm getting drilled by Gotango at the same time. <laughs> I really didn't know what to do. But it's funny to look at. This only happened a week ago. Just realized now I know what to do but like a week ago it's it's crazy how your you know skill and no knowledge on what to actually do improves in like a small week it's crazy because I was like when I saw this 18th of uh, January I'm like oh wait this happened a week ago probably did it recently but uh, <laughs> look at that glitch right there <laughs> it didn't even showcase as a 
Well, I, I guess I still don't know how to pronounce it though. Oh boy, I'm gonna look back at this video later when I do know how to pronounce it. I'm gonna be like, oh, Gosley, it's pronounced that. Oh, this is really. Oh, it's gonna be drilled in the back. <laughs> and ah, oh, perfect timing, Gosley. Ah, oh, I did have some skill. I did. I have <laughs> beginners luck. That's what I think it's called. I, I kind of knew what to do, but I'm not collecting the data points. I think I just realized on how to do that now. No? I'm getting a bit concerned. I have 100% data right now, but I don't know if I did it in this episode. Now Space Godzilla, I wanna have a piece of, piece of me. I'm trying to fight a tango first. I'm just totally... <laughs> I like all the fact that I'm totally ignoring the Space Godzilla. <laughs> Even when I think this was my first time encountering the Space Godzilla, I was like, what do you want? I know, yeah, I think I did a lot of running because the Space Godzilla was, oh my word, a very difficult kaiju. At first, you know, you don't know what it, the attacks are and how to actually counter it and how to actually, you know, battle it correctly. So I think I was just mostly running around at this point, just running away. <laughs> and then I saw Kotango coming in again. And I was too late. That was too late. <laughs> Again on a data point. Hello, Space Godzilla. I was just kept on running, especially on the r live stream. Because, uh, yeah, I was very newbie on the live stream. I think I did it correctly now. Your tango is going down. Yeah. When, uh, well, same as Super X. When it says it's badly damaged, it means it's destroyed. Basically. You cannot destroy it, you can only damage it to a certain point where it flees. And doesn't come back again. It's the same as destroyed, but, uh,. Oh, I didn't know what the roars did as well. I was like, oh, that, that's a cool feature. But I should have did the atomic breath uh, right after I roared. Oh, boy. And went straight to the stone. <laughs> Great job, Gozzy. There we go. When am I going to defeat the Space Godzilla? I think I was too intimidated to attack it full on. Even though I was kind of the same height. Right now, if I was battling it and if I had the controls, I was like, okay, let's bring it, let's do this. But <laughs> the fact that the Space Godzilla was a bit bigger than me was like, oh my word, why am I even doing this? Yes, that didn't do anything. <laughs> and then I was like, oh wait, that didn't do anything. <laughs> let me just back off real quick and let me just run for the 50th time. <laughs> am I collecting the data now? Data, please collect it. Ah, extra bonus. Ah, that. Ah, I also went for the extra bonus. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> Do I even? I think I lost actually. Did I even win? <laughs> There's three minutes left of this match, and Space Godzilla is just past the 75 percent. Oh, I think I grew balls now. Oh, I think. Oh, I think I'm attacking it now correctly. <laughs> I think I'm actually doing it right now. Use your atomic breath when it roars. There we go. Okay, well, that helped. <laughs> go, Gozzy! <laughs> Gozzy from the past. I am from the future. There we go. Oof. Space Godzilla will go down. Epic combo. No, not the grab, Gozzy. I'm clicking the wrong buttons. <laughs> Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, I actually, okay, defeated it. But I didn't collect the data points. Huh. Okay, I totally forgot about that. I was too concentrated on <laughs> knocking down this uh, space Godzilla. And I was like, ah, oh, no, get away from me. There we go. Apparently, he also has a shield. This is space Godzilla is the only kaiju uh, slash Godzilla that could have a proper shield. Because in this game, you cannot block. You can only kind of counter and attack. You could not block an attack. Oh, now I was trying to get the data point. But Space Godzilla actually does have a shield. It's the only Godzilla and only Kaiju in the game that has a shield, which is pretty cool if, if you think about it. But I've been in online battles and almost no one uses the Space Godzilla. Kind of sad though. Everyone just uses the overpowered end battle go Godzillas and Kaijus and stuff like that. I think I was back and now I'm gonna get the other data point. <laughs> I'm trying to like juke it because I thought it was gonna do the atomic breath. When are you gonna do it? Collect it now, Gossy! What are you doing? Ah, ah, I was waiting for the correct moment. There we go. Data collection is proceeding as planned. There we go. Data collection. 
even though I'm doing it. There we go. Going for it. And for the final data point. You got this. The final run. I didn't even do the 100% destruction rate. But I didn't know what that was for. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it fly off. I like it. <laughs> Too bad you can't fly backwards there. Oh well. That would have... That would have, would have been so much better. Come on, Space Godzilla. What do you got? What do you got? I think we were both on uh, low health. And I didn't know how to use the atomic breath correctly. That's why I did the sweeping one. Oh, what? It didn't do it now? I was like, okay. And there we go. I think I did it. Yes. Two units of evolution factor, Space Godzilla. There we go. So, that was epic. GG's in chat. <laughs> what we did in live stream. That is all for this game. Hope you all enjoyed it. Wanna swipe in around the bottom that subscribe bell button to get notified for dinosaur and Godzilla content as soon as possible. Get your new merch at teespring.com slash store slash LP Gozzi. And uh, yeah, let me know if you want to see more Godzilla goodness. Would that be sort of as a great I'll see all your lovely Raptor members, Godzilla Kaiju members in the next episode. Alpha Interrupter, out. <laughs>